Good morning, George Kelichek, Chairman, Rockdale Soilwater Conservation District, and also Chairman for the Upper Okmulgee River, River Basin Area, which includes eight counties uh, within the metro area. We work in unison with the Metropolitan North Georgia Water Planning District, and that is part of the Atlanta Regional Commission. So I do have the University of Georgia here with us today. I have the <clears throat> Fort Valley State University, which has program 1890, which is fully funded by the U.S. Department of Agriculture. If a student goes to Fort Valley State, they will be provided $32,840 for their education, which would include room and board, books and meals and housing. And they could come out of there with a degree in agribusiness and or technology with no college debt and be able to work in this wonderful agribusiness industry in Georgia, which agribusiness is our number one industry, providing over $74 billion into the Georgia economy in 2023. Now I'm proud to have today Ms. Jill Hanser, who is our operations manager for the Georgia Agribusiness Council. And so Jill, I'll turn it over to you now and share some information with the folks. Yes, so I'm Jill and I'm with the Georgia Agribusiness Council and we are a nonprofit trade association that represents anyone in agriculture, whether it's a small farmer, all the way to the grocery stores, to lawyers, to policy makers. One of the biggest things we do is we are at the Capitol every day um, trying to make sure that agriculture is supported and that the industry has a voice at the Capitol. Um, we also do scholarships and classroom grants so that kids going into ag and in any any type of agriculture area, they can get a scholarship with us. Um, we have classroom grants for teachers who they want to do an ag project so that they can teach students about agriculture, where their food comes from, where their clothes come from. Um, we do offer those as well. Um, so we're just glad to be here and to support the ag industry in any way we can. I'm Farmer D and I'm excited to be here at the Ag Expo talking to youth about careers in ag. Um, I started in college, got interested in farming, uh, pursued my passion, found my passion in agriculture. And uh, for the last 25 years, I've been working on designing and building farms and communities all over the country. Um, I wrote a book called Citizen Farmers about 10 years ago. And my son actually inspired me when he was nine, when he started his own farm business through school. Um, and I worked with him and his friends to start a CSA, a community supported agriculture business. And they grew food for 15 families and they loved it. And it activated the farm that I had actually started 20 plus years ago and it made me realize we need more of these programs. We need more kids uh, connecting to farms, getting off their screens, getting their hands in the soil, growing food, learning about eating healthy food. So we're really excited that, that you know Georgia is such a wonderful place to do this work. Uh, agriculture is such a big part of our, our culture and uh, actually bringing more of that cultural aspects of farming and food into communities.